so this is what I have done so far um, for this comic page thing I'm trying to do um, and I was literally thinking oh my god record like you barely post on YouTube just record but the love of god record so here we are I'm recording on my phone um, it's been a while it's been a while but I managed to clear up some space and I'm just gonna see how long I can record before it just completely you know runs out of space here are my OCs AJ and Noah I really love how Noah's face is turning out right now there he is um, I feel like I finally captured what he looks like hopefully I don't hit a really bad ugly stage that just makes me completely give up on this piece because it is very possible but I feel confident I feel confident but before we start I would like to thank the sponsor of today's video Milanotes. Milanotes is a mood board app for creatives designed to promote productivity and organization Milanote allows you to easily compile notes, videos, photos, and more all in the one place. There are over 100 built-in templates available for users. You can select one as a base or you can freestyle. You have the option to import your own photos from your gallery or search up one using their built-in image library. It's very easy to create a project. Simply drag and drop from the toolbar and arrange your contents as you please. You can add arrows and columns for a more organized look. They also allow you to add color swatches, links, and even draw on the canvas. What I found from using this tool is that it's very convenient. As an artist, I often have many ideas and resource materials in mind for drawing. I'm prone to getting sidetracked easily. And with Milanote, I feel more focused on the task after I've created my boards. If you'd like to perhaps collaborate with others, you can share your boards and interact with one another's work in real time. Milanote is also available for free on other devices such as Mac OS, iPhone, and Android. It also has instant syncing to all your devices. If you're interested in checking it out, I will have all the information in my description box. Hi, so as you can see, I am working on uh, completing this page, this, um, this mini comic thing idea I have. You know, I, I was, as I was working on it, I was like, yeah, why not record, you know, because I haven't posted in a while and, you know what I mean? I, I felt comfortable enough to, to record, so I did so and here we are. Um, right now, I am just basically cleaning up uh, the line art and stuff, making it neater and yeah, I... I enjoy this video and, and the artwork as well because I wanted to, it's something that I struggle with. The idea of, you know, making like a comic or it's so daunting to me, um, but I love the look of it and I wanted to challenge myself to like do like a mini comic basically, something that is, you know, what I like about comics but like not as heavy you know so like no real like uh, story but like you know what I mean like it's just a, sm a small kind of random maybe non-context given scenario you know and you just you just see it and it's just characters interacting with each other it's so fun t to be able to do and I, I want to do more of that but I scare easily at the thought of it but I thought I'd push myself and try it um, and yeah uh, in this video, I'm just showing you just like the one, am I stupid? <laughs> what do I say? What's it called? In this video, I'm just showing you, um, just the one page, um, that I decided to record. Uh, this is the second page. I chose this one because it was just more prettier. Um, it had just, yeah, it was just prettier. It had their faces in it. At the time of recording, the first page isn't even like done either. I haven't started that one. I just have like a sketch for it um but yeah it's a lot simpler than this one so it shouldn't take long with this one it did kind of take i mean honestly when i think back to it it didn't take as long as i thought it would 
like I was prepared like kind of to be sat here for a while constantly tweaking stuff but thankfully it didn't take that long um it feels like it did because I took a break because as you see later well I guess you won't see or maybe you might not be able to tell but later on when I start like putting in like some details in her face just coloring her face more um shading like on the, all that I was struggling and I I ended up uh having to I, I basically I ended up yeah just taking a break longer than I thought I would and then I came back finally and sat down and just basically restarted the whole face facial shading situation and it came out so much better on the second half Unfortunately, I didn't get any footage of that second half because, like, I don't know about you guys, but for me, whenever it comes to filming, things get, like, very stressful and, like, art seems just, like, ten times harder um, sometimes because I just have, like, this feeling of, like, pressure to perform well, you know what I mean? Like, I can't be sitting here erasing, you know, all the time and, you know? And I didn't want to stress myself, especially after, you know, struggling as much as I was. So I thought, you know what, let me start off just like no cameras, just very chill, very slow, you know, take all the time you need. You know what I mean? You can do this. Like you've done this before. Like you're not stupid. Like you've done this before. You didn't lose that skill. Um, and yeah, I, I got carried away and I, cause usually I'm be, like, I'll, if I'm not recording, initially but i wanted to record i will wait until like i'm getting into like the swing of things like just really like feeling calm and cool collected about it and then i'll turn on the camera but i completely forgot about that like i was very like focused and yeah i just yeah it was it was it was it came out so much better and then and i was like damn i forgot to record that i did record a good chunk of um the process which i'm happy i did Oh my god, that was another thing I forgot. Um, another thing that also contributed to me uh, not like get it, grabbing the camera immediately was because I, like I mentioned in the intro, I like recently, like I was able to clear up space on my phone to record on my phone and that's what I've been recording with for the longest time until I ran out of space and yeah it just it's so much easier for me personally to just use a phone I just press record and I can forget about the camera basically yeah it just it felt more comfortable for me and but at the same time yes I did clear up space but not a ton so I was worried even when I was filming these two or these these clips I was worried that it was just gonna shut off like any second. I didn't even want to check just how much space exactly I, I had saved. Um, but I'd find myself like periodically glancing at the the uh, my phone to see if it's still like recording or if it had crashed, like how it done before in the past to ind indicate that it's full. Um, but thankfully, no, that didn't happen. And yeah, I actually did get a new phone with more space and. I'm hoping that now I'll have less excuses to um, not post here or to not film, but we'll see how that goes because, wow, I can get very, is it lazy? I don't know. So with the comic, that I'm trying to do here. It's a short mini comic. Um, I have the idea of it being like three pages long. You know what I mean? Um, so yeah, this is just one page and um, hopefully when I'm done, I'm gonna post it. I don't know which is gonna be done first or posted first, the image or the video? Who knows? I'll see, anyway. I mean, I guess if you're watching this, you know, but um anyway the idea was just i had like a really random like actually it wasn't it wasn't random it kind of you know that audio on tiktok um i saw it on on a reel on instagram somewhere i don't actually really use tiktok oh my god anyway but it was uh a song by 
tank and the not me forgetting hold on tank and the bangers hold on let me tank and the bangers i think that's i hope i'm not pronouncing that right but it was really cute and very sweet and i was just like oh my god i want to do this like with these two characters um it was a really cute silly idea i don't know like it was one of those ideas that i'd probably be like yeah that would be kind of cute and then like forget in my head but i i pushed myself to actually do it initially i had planned to have this out in for valentine's day um i think i had the idea the idea to draw this in february um like three two or three days before i think it was three days before valentine's day and i was like i was like oh my god imagine like that would be really cute you know what i mean like to make maybe make a reel out of it like that would be kind of cute and creative i don't know but all i managed to get done was just like the very first like initial like thumbnailing i think and then i was like well i'm still gonna get it done but it's gonna come out later <laughs> and here we are like a whole month later um but i mean now at least it's, it's done or at least one page is right now as of recording but yeah yeah i'm trying to not like immediately shoot down some ideas because the more i thought about it i was like this is so silly and like ugh, you know what i mean like does this really make sense like as in like is it like good enough to try and like put energy into da 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 literally like trying to talk myself out of it which is so such a flaw i have what the heck like i'm i'm so glad i just pushed past those silly thoughts and i just i just pushed past those thoughts and i just went for it because it, it made me so happy yeah it's cute to look at i look at this and i just i giggle like an idiot this is so fun i'm also really proud of how their faces came out like that's something i struggle with all the time oh my god i actually did struggle with it a little bit here on aj's face um you can't i feel like you can't really tell maybe it's it's because of the angle my camera's slightly angled but no like her face is a bit i had to like liquefy it a little bit um shift the nose down and stuff like that fix her hair but in the end like it does i, I feel happy i feel really satisfied with her face like i think her face came out so nice her lips i love drawing lips oh my god it came out really good so i'm proud of that no it's good to have like um you know to just be focused about certain things and that's something that i kind of do lack a bit so yeah using like miller notes and stuff like that was nice to have like just something to remind me like not only just um the fact that the thing was sponsored and so it had to get posted but also just it was also good for me because i really wanted this thing to get out you know what i mean and so yeah that was that was really good going forward i need to try harder to be more focused and really make the time for it as well oh towards the end you'll see me like of this video i think literally the end of the video you'll see me try to add a border i was going back and forth if i should add a border or not because you know i i think like i like the look of like I like the idea of having a border, but with the way I had placed my characters, I don't know, I was kind of struggling. Like, I don't know, I wasn't really liking the look. It felt too busy. Did it? I don't know. I was like, you know what, maybe I should just leave it to be just a blank, you know, just a white background. In the end, I just chose to just do it my own way and not feel too, like, uh, worried about trying to get it to look like like how maybe like most people would make their web comics like oh you know you have to have this and that. like I was just, I was just like you know what in the end of the, at the end of the day like this is supposed to be fun like I'm I want to have fun with it I don't want to stress myself out like fun only okay so yeah that's really all I have to say I hope you enjoy watching the video uh, and like I mentioned earlier before check uh, my description box for more information on Miller Notes. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Bye.